Hey there guys, my name is Travis Phil. I'm a rig welder with Legion Pipe and Fabricators and we are in the Nisku Legion Fabrication Shop, Alberta, Canada. And I got my friend Jay-Z here and he's going to be doing a welding demonstration on 6010 roots, 1018 fill and cap on the 6 uh, inch get 40 pipe. Uh, Jay-Z, what do you think? Let's get at her. Okay, well, let's weld. Jay-Z is going to start doing the 6010 uh, root pass here. He's using a very slight downhill welding progression and he's just dragging the root, root in, just like pipeline welding. Also, I wanted to mention, you know, the welding helmets we were welding. Weldlife.com here. Daisy has a nice uh, floral pattern, really gorgeous color, so we'll be using these. GZ is pretty coming up to the uh, high in here very, very quickly. So basically, GZ is going to be doing a 6010 hot pass on here. This is another technique for uh, kind of like a hot pass roll weld, depending on your welding procedure, you know. So it just kind of looks kind of cool, so we're just going to go with it. Just that, uh, that destruction of the 6010 arc is just chewing and eating everything away that's in the weld puddle there, or in the base material cleaning all the uh, weld, any, uh, anything that could be in the root pass, just clean it all out. Well, it looks kind of cool on camera here, so. You can see that nice, uh, the root pass is a uh, nice red. Now, the other funny thing with the 6010 hot pass Say if you're doing a position weld, say if you're doing like a heavy weld, you can't tell what your roof house looks like on position weld. You kind of want to see, you kind of want to know, and can't really access, uh, you know, you need to remove that flux somehow, the flux coating on the 6010 root. If you put 60, if you slightly grind into it and you put 6010 over it, you know, um, it will, take your, your welding flux and it'll be easier, it'll push the root in, but it'll also be easier to knock the flux off. If you put 7018 over that weld area, it'll caramelize your flux and it'll be very difficult to uh, get, the, uh, get the flux off there. If you're trying to tip it and trying to visually inspect it, make sure you got a good tie-in or you, you, you know, caught an edge if there's a big misalignment and other things. Just a little trick. So this pass is going to be a, a fill pass, and I believe Jay-Z has, he might have a quarter inch, or he might have a three, five, three, I think he has a quarter inch. So he's got a quarter inch, uh, 718 he's filling this with. And if you watch him, he's going to be tipping his start here. So uh, you'll see that. He has a file in his left hand and he's just going to hit the start with his, with his left there. I'll knock the flux off and he'll be able to do a really nice tie-in. Okay, there he is, he's knocking the flux off. in. All right, well, uh, Jay-Z is now trying to put the cat pass on here. Cat pass with, uh, I believe it's a quarter inch. 
probably, probably over maybe about 320 amps or so, 330. This will be the uh, finishing pass on the weld. It's just about done the cat pass, probably about halfway around. And with this quarter inch, I'll make it all the way around with, on the sixth inch, skid 40 pipe all the way around. watching the video here. DZ did a fantastic weld with the uh, uh, 6010 roots, and 18 drilling cap and the 16 skid 40 pipe with his engine drive welding machine. And um, the welding machine, or the welding helmets that we're wearing in the video here, these are the weldlife.com from Weld2. Fantastic helmet, there's a nice floor design on this helmet there, and I got the nice block that matches everything I'm wearing here. So, um, you know, if you want to see more welding videos, please follow and subscribe on uh, uh, WeldTube's Instagram channel and also on their YouTube. Thank you.